<laughs> Welcome guys. Um, this is me again, Vibit, with my co-host Jason. Hello guys. This is our guest Trudy. I'll Hello. introduce her a bit later. But yeah, I just want to apologize for our long absence of the end of last year. I don't know if you guys know, but me and Jason, we both had COVID together, so <coughs> I was oh we're done with COVID. <laughs> um, we had to isolate a bit together, so yeah, it was a sad time. And the <laughs> other guest today is my friend Trudy. Trudy! So, Trudy, can you introduce yourself, please? Tell Hello the people about everyone. you. Everyone, I am Trudy, and I know these two guys from church, and we also go to every run together. The other church. <laughs> <laughs> I like a bunch of people and I was born in George, moved around a lot and then I we, we stay in Mosaba at the moment for like the past more than 10 years. I've been there in high school, then I came to Stellenbosch to study food science and now I'm working in Stellenbosch as an organic auditor. Yeah, what's my claim to fame? I can bake pumpkin. Pumpkin Ter. bread. How do you say pumpkin bread? <laughs> pumpkin bread. Pumpkin bread. Pumpkin bread. Yeah. <laughs> so when am I getting pumpkin bread? When are we having a bra? I can do pumpkin bread. Yeah. And very good potato bake with bacon and cream. Oh my word. Okay, the list just goes uh, on. Militar. Oh, militar. Can you make all the tears? Can you make okay, peppermint tears? I haven't tried. Because that is the tear that's uh, gonna. Okay. That's like. And what is your go to meal if you invite someone over? <laughs> but, but here's a question for you How do you mentally prepare oh, no. <laughs> for a burger on a Tuesday? How's that? Uh, I've, the last time I've eaten was around 1 o'clock. So. I've been preparing internally here also. Yeah, was, uh, <laughs> shall, we, shall we tell her what the ritual is? <laughs> so normally, right, we sit outside before the sun comes up, right? Because that symbolizes the bottom bun. <laughs> when the sun like the foundation, <laughs> the start of the day. Exactly, the start of the day. Like It's like we read the same thing, this is cool. Okay, cool. And then, then I think, wow, meat, 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 and then like how the patty's gonna meet the bun, right? That's also how I meet other people in the day. Meet and greet, meet, yeah. I understand, I get you. <laughs> and then, I sit there the whole day. Until the sun goes down and that's the that's the top bun. That's how I meant to prepare. And then you eat the burger? Um, yeah, then I eat it, then I eat it. I'm getting hungry now. Tell them about the beer, Jason. What beer is it? Okay, um, it is the Royal Dutch Post Horn 1806. Yeah, better believe it. Alcohol content. Oh, it's got a 5% alcohol content. Really nice. As you know, I really I love beer, so I'll be drinking all of this tonight. We'll tell you how the burger stays later. But now this is a good beer, so... This is a good yes. beer! Cheers! Cheers! This is my first Cheers. official Cheers. own beer. I've never ordered my own beer. Like, there it goes. <laughs> Cheers! 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 Oh, yeah. Sorry, the other one's just going to take two minutes. No worries. Sorry. No worries. No worries. No worries. You can there's have chicken. There's beef. Which you? one shall I take? Yeah. Which one are you are you going to take? Fifty bucks. It's 99 rand for two, right? This So basically 50 rand for one. You get this amazing burger. I haven't tasted it yet, so I don't know. And a bunch of chips. And a beer. <laughs> and You're not even getting this for 50 bucks. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be so much better. The longest two minutes ever. Firstly the chips. Can, I, can we start with the chips? Yo, this looks nice. Let me just smell. Taste it. Taste it. Taste it. Can we taste it? Taste it. Oh man, I wanted to hear the mm. crunch. Mm. Is it crunchy or what? Mm. Not crunchy. But it's still good. 
It's still good. I like this price. You gotta do something with those Got some chopsticks. Yeah, yeah. So, so we also have some nice onion rings. Tell us how they taste. Okay, um, 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 okay. I need to actually tell you something about Vibert though. A secret that he tries to keep and that our editor wants to hear a lot about. He loves it. That Vibert, he loves onion rings. I love onion rings too. I think that's why you're your friends. That's why you're friends. Spur onion rings, any onion rings. Several months later. Okay, yeah, it's coming. It's coming. Uh, are they warm? Nice and warm? Okay. It's a mess. It's really a mess. But here goes. Okay, Vibert's in for the first bike. Trudy as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, first thoughts. What are you What are you thinking? Mm. A lot of taste. Mm. But can you see the meat? Okay, they're speechless. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. It's a good thing, guys. It's a good thing. I don't know what to say about this burger. It's very tasty. Very tasty. Mm. Like, I'm gonna be honest. I've had better burgers. But... For this price, I haven't seen a better burger ever in my life. Wow. Chicken burger, here we go. Very fresh, very thick. I like it. Like this might be this might be a good rival for like what I thought was the best burger in Stellenbosch at the moment. For the for the price. For the price. Yeah, for the for price. price. For the price, yeah, yeah. I still prefer the beef. I think yeah. the beef is tastier. Mm. Okay, okay. But this is a massive chicken burger. It's not bad, it's not good. What would you have liked to see? Uh, like, what would you like to add to this? If something. A sauce? Another topping? Still the Nothing. Sauce. I want my tomato sauce, but I don't see it here. Oh. No, no, no. You need to cut some sauces, man. Like, there's enough sauce in here. Like. Good point. So you don't want your tomato sauce. Yo, I, like, I want it, but I don't want it. Do you want it for the chips? I don't want it. Yeah. Okay. The chips are so nice. You can put Yo, it in the chips. exactly. There's a nice spice on there. So, yeah, guys, this was, I think, a good evening. I'm pretty sure I'm going to come back sometime soon. I love this deal and so for my rating I it's probably my best rating that I've ever done for any restaurant that says a lot and for presentation I'll give them a nine I love the plates that they had it's just yeah in the burger looked so appetizing with the chips in this little thingy I loved it so presentation nine for me taste I will give a 8.5 um, the beef burger was very juicy that wasn't a proper like beef patty it's falling apart a bit but just still the sauce that they had on there was so nice and even the chicken burger was also very nice i love the beef more than the chicken but 8.5 for me on taste still think it's decent atmosphere i'll give it a nine love the vibe they have in here the restaurant is nice and full but still it's not too loud in here they've got some music that i can chat normally without screaming at people so 9 on atmosphere size, I'll give a 9. Um, I love the fries and also we got a beer included. Like how insane is that? Pay 50 bucks, get a beer also in. That's ridiculous. Portion size, I'll give him a 9.5. The amount that you pay, you're not supposed to get that much food. Like it's just ridiculous. The food was enough. I loved it. It was good. And that brings me to average value of money rating of nine and yeah guys try out the song let's try out the special i loved it pretty sure you're also gonna love it so yeah it's just 50 bucks here goes my rating so for presentation like everyone mentioned when the plate came here it looked appetizing it looked good like i was i was drilling but that's a natural thing for me i like to drill but like yeah it looked very good so i give it a eight then for taste Juicy, salty, very good taste, not dry at all when I look at the beef, but I think the quality of the beef, beef brings my brings my score down to 6.5 and then on the chicken side I'm not going to rate that but it was also very good, um, 
nice piece of chicken, maybe a bit drier in comparison with beef. Then for atmosphere, I like sitting here chatting with Vibert and Jason and the seats are very comfortable. Um, I, yeah, this place looks good with the dog. I was like, don't you say mahogany wood? But anyway, I give the atmosphere eight. And then for the sides, when I look at the chips, nice seasoning, lacquer chips, and also thinking, thinking about, the fact, about the fact that you got a free beer, I give it a seven. Portion size. I think it's rather good portion size. Um, enough chips, a big lacquer burger, and then also with a lot of things on there. So for that, I give it an eight. It was a good, good one. Oh my scores together give me an overall of 7.5 thank you asami it was good we will see you again maybe this time for sushi my rating for asami um, i just like to say thank you asami this has been such a great special um yeah so i'll start off with the presentation um the food came in like this basket with a plate on top of it and it looked amazing, like the size of the burger, it was just amazing. Um, the, the chips as well, not the crispiest chips, but very, very tasty. So yeah, that actually gets me to taste. Um, I had the chicken burger, I'm not a chicken burger fan. Um, yeah, I'm gonna give it a six. I don't think I set my rating for presentation. It was a seven, it was a seven. The atmosphere, I really like what the, like how it looks and everyone seems to be enjoying themselves. Um, the music's not too loud, so they did great there. That's a seven for me. Besides though, um, I'm gonna give them a six on that. Um, yeah, the chips were really nice, but I would have liked if there was some variety in the sides. Uh, please don't hate me for that. The portion size, it was a lot of food. So unfortunately, I'm gonna give it a low rating, like a six. Um, but okay, that being said, that's me. I don't like a lot of a lot of food. I didn't even finish all of it. But if you like a lot of food, please come take the special. It's really amazing. It's a lot of food that you're getting for the price. I'd actually say it would be the best burger to get right now for the price. And then that brings me to a total of um, oh sorry, a value for money of 6.4. So once again, thanks Asami. What a great special. I just want to say again, this isn't the best burger in Stellenbosch, you can quote me on that. Sorry Asami, you don't have the best burger in Stellenbosch, but for specials, this might be the best special in Stellenbosch. Mm. The value for money mm. is just... It's crazy. Crazy. Where do you get 50 Rand? Burger and the beer. And the beer. No. And nice just, chips. No. Like, not even that other place that you said. Yeah, not, not even, even that other place. Um, you can go to fast food chains and you're not going to get the value for money that you just got here. It's just ridiculous how cheap it was. Mm. So come and try it out. They really, they deliver. So I'm very happy. Also, guys, this is us eating burgers at Asami. This was a very nice special. So thank you, Asami. We really loved it.